Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So we have a new version of the Mozilla Firefox web browser on desktop, version 105, which is now the latest release, and was made available earlier today on the 20th of September 2022. Now, when it comes to uh, new features, um, I would consider version 105 to be a little bit thin on the ground in that department. And um, the key highlights I would consider to be uh, the bug fixes and the security updates which have rolled out. And um, the main improvement would be that there's better handling of low memory situations um, of the browser on um, um, Windows and Linux, um, resulting in fewer crashes of the browser if you are using it on those two operating systems. Now, um, at first, as always, to double check if you have this latest uh, version, we head to the menu, click on Help, About Firefox, and the latest release now is on 105.0. Now, um, just to um, go through a couple of the um, new features, which I would um, consider to be um, of uh, main interest for the purposes of this video. And the first is regarding a new print option that's been made available in version 105. And um, they've added an option to print only the current page. Um, from the print preview dialog. So now you can print any current page from the preview dialog of the print menu. And then um, swipe to navigate on Windows is now enabled. So you can use two fingers on a touchpad, swipe left or right to perform history back or forward. And that's on Windows now. Swipe to navigate enabled in version 105. And then um, searching in large lists for individual items is now two times faster according to Mozilla. So that's a little bit of a performance boost when it comes to searching large lists. And then um, to mention those all important bug fixes, as mentioned, um, the first um, stability on Windows is um, improved as the browser handles um, low memory situations much better. And Firefox is also less likely to run out of memory on Linux and performs more efficiently for the rest of the system when memory runs low. So that's in an out of memory situation when the operating system basically runs out of memory. And as mentioned on both um, Windows and Linux now, the browser handles those low memory situations a lot more efficiently and better now in version 105. And then touchpad uh, scrolling, um, it has been improved if you are using Firefox on Mac OS. Now, um, as always, there's also those all important security updates that have been made available in version 105. And uh, just to mention um, those uh, quickly, um, there are seven, sec seven security fixes that have rolled out addressing seven vulnerabilities. And out of those vulnerabilities that have been fixed, uh, three are high risk vulnerabilities, which is your second highest ranked after a critical impact vulnerability. So um, it's important to double check that your browser is up to date um, because of those security updates, even if you're not even interested in any new features or major changes. Now, just to mention the high impact vulnerabilities that have been addressed. Um, the first is certain pages did not have their feature policy fully initialized, leading to a bypass that leaked device permissions into untrusted documents. Um, the second, um, non-UTF-8 non data was not thread safe. And according to Mozilla, this could lead to a use after free causing a potentially exploitable crash. And then the third high risk vulnerability that's been fixed in version 105 was a memory safety bug issue. Some of these bugs showed evidence of memory corruption and, and Mozilla says they presumed that with enough effort, some of these could have been exploited to run arbitrary code. And as always, um, if you'd like a more in-depth look at the release notes, you can just click on what's new in the version menu. Uh, which will take you to the release notes and you can just go through that for more in-depth information and if you are a developer you can click on developer information where there are six improvements for developers and um, so you can just click on that link if you are a developer to get all that information regarding those improvements and um, then version 106 which will be the next major release and um, according to Mozilla and their release schedule will be rolling out um, on the 18th of, of October next month. So that's on the 18th of October, we can expect to see version 106 uh, roll out. And for version 105 this month, um, as mentioned, over and above the all important security fixes, the main improvement um, is um, the better handling of low memory situations of the browser on Windows and Linux. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.